All right, this is Q and A video. This question is from Joe Smith in Palm Springs. Palm Springs. Hi, Jackie. Can you do a bit of the use of archive in Filmora and how you can save and use it on another computer? Thanks. All right, it is very easy. Let me show you how to do that. For example, I have a project here and I'm editing on my laptop, for example. And now if I want to edit this project on another computer, all I need to do is to go to File and select Archive Project or we have the shortcut here, Control Shift A, I just press this one. And now you need to give it a name for the project. Okay, so now I'm going to save this project to my external drive, which is the SSD right here. And then just make it example project. And remember, this is a project file, and the file extension will be Wondershare Filmora bundle, project bundle. It is not Wondershare Filmora project. Okay, and then we can click save. All right, and now you have the bundles on your external drive. For example, let's open it. Okay, on my external drive. And this is my external rise. Okay, just open it. And we have Filmora example project and the size is 675 megabyte. And now we can just unplug the right, this one. Okay, and now you can just bring this to another computer and copy that file to your computer and it should be okay. Okay, for example, I'm going to close the project right now. And if I plug in the external drive to this, okay, to this computer, and we can create a new project. And then we're going to select file to open, open a new project, okay, on our external drive. Uh, this is the external drive and this is the example project. Just select it and then click open. Okay, and now we can click OK to extract everything inside that bundle. Just click OK. Assemble project. Alright, and now we have the project here. So we can edit it on another computer. So that is how to use the archive project. I hope this video is helpful for you, especially Joe. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.